holy smoke box boys, a holy smoke box is recorded. Yeah. <laughs> Vice is pure open man, it's letting in all the no years. Yeah. We're out and about boys, you know the drill, you know the motherfucking drill, we're out here cruising about, yeah, making content, nah, yeah, we're making content boys, yeah. It's fucking windy again man, what time is it? Getting close to 12 o'clock, oh, I feel myself biting it. I feel myself biting the inside of my mouth there. I've got a funny feeling I might do that again. I feel it feels like my mouth is my gum sticking more into the into my is my cheek sticking more into my teeth than normal at the minute. Like it's a bit swollen or something. Um yeah, that vise is open. I don't know what that noise is doing, to be honest. I don't know what that wind is doing. Is it going to be nice or is it not going to be nice? I don't know. I don't know, boys. Yeah, I've been thinking about vlogging for about two weeks. Yeah, a couple of hours. And um, I've been trying to think of where to go. Can't think of nowhere. Same old routes. Just me having a good old chin wag on that nice little shit GoPro. GoPro 3, might I add, yeah? Oldest one going, nearly. It's a GoPro 3 Plus, I think. Which is the second oldest one. I think there was a GoPro 3. Was there a GoPro 1 or 2 before that? I don't know. Anyway, this is an old GoPro. I've had this for fucking... Yonky, donkey, nonky, trunky, zonky. Yeah, ages boys, right? Ages. That wind, boys, let's get that closed up. Fucking windy noise and times and all them times and wimes and grinds. <laughs> Straight up to the limit. And then we stopped, boys, right? We stopped on the limit. So we don't get penalised. <laughs> Sheep in that! Yeah, I've got to be careful, you know. I can feel my right cheek keeps going inside my teeth. Stuff's getting bitten if I'm not careful. Yeah, you're sitting in your house, man. It looks all nice and spice, but you come out and it's that much wind, man. It's blowing the hair under my helmet. However that happens, I don't know, but it's windy, boys. That's how it happens couple of motorbikes behind me there, overtaking the traffic and that. They would have been past me soon enough. Oh, what the fuck is that? I, went, I, was, I, I was actually leaning a little bit back then. Getting like that view in, you know where you can see the dash, boys. You just want to see the dash, don't you? Don't you want to see the dash? So I'm back like these times so you can see the dash, boys. Yeah, and that's how you get the wheel up, ain't it? What the fuck? I swear, I just... I just changed up then. I was I was about to... To blip that and, like, pretend to do a wheelie. But I actually leaned back a bit, so it probably... I didn't sit back, just leaned back a bit. So it probably would have assisted it a little bit. But at the same time, I actually dumped the clutch. I actually dropped it, uh, put it up to third. So it was never going to wheelie, was it? <laughs> it is windy, man. The fucking eyes is shaking about, boys. I love that farm, I love that view there from that farm, just like a massive driveway, same length as my knob, and then like a farm at the end. It's, uh, yeah, 
I wouldn't mind a farm with a massive driveway, the same length as my knob, and then a fucking farm at the end. You know them times. I want one. Yeah, look, you can, it's clear signs that it's wet. There's loads of puddles and mud either side of me. And here I am thinking I might do a bit off the road in. Not at all, boys. Look at all this sloppy doppy. Look at it all. There's puddles and shiz. We ain't getting up to no good. Go and have a little look anyway. Oh, you motherfucking bitch, man. We nearly done the wheelie then times. Nah. Nah, I ain't risking it, boys. Do I want to go through there? Nah, there's probably a puddle of some kind and I'll get stuck, won't I? Oh, that back wheel went out a little bit then. But look at that, a tiniest little wheel spin, you know, boys. Tiniest little mark there, you know. Did I do anything then? Yeah, left a little bit of smoke. There it is there, just going away. I must have done a wee burn out there. We must have done a burn out, boys. <laughs> Nah, 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 that was, it. I just crashed it, didn't I? Nah, I don't know what I'm doing, boys. I never have known what I'm doing. <laughs> what do I? Got that on video, didn't I? No, you know, if I can get a nooch, man. You guys know what you're doing because you've been doing it for Yonky Donk and Nonk and Tronk and Vonk and Zonk. Ages, boys, yeah? Let's go and have a look at the evidence of my little burn out there. She is, uh, yeah, that's about 10 inch little burn out there. Come on, I've done a 10 inch burn out. Um, this is what I was looking at. Uh, it's plenty easy enough to get through there. Plenty easy enough. I'm dead scared though, like... <coughs> Perdón. Not like dead scared, but... You know, I'm always thinking of, of the worst, worst case scenarios and then times. <sighs> Smell the fingers. I always say that because I like putting my hand over the exhaust because it makes it listen. Listen. Do you hear that shit? Yeah, take them away. Put them back. Take them away. Put them back. Say nothing, boys. Yeah, say nothing. Put it over the exhaust. Trust. Smell the fingers. What? All right, let's get out of here. Uh, I was considering taking a photo then, but I can't be bothered now. Talk too much, didn't I? Oh, I feel like going through there now. Now I checked that it was um, not muddy. I'm on the pegs here, boys, and proper daredevil them times. Hear that, hear that, come on. Yeah, <laughs> I've done it, boys. Come on, that was the one. That was, look, 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 I've got evidence, boys. I've got evidence, look. Man done the burnout, there's my burnout evidence. <laughs> I say nothing. There's my evidence right down there, boys. Whoa, you fucker. <laughs> Proper F A G G O T stuff, isn't it? Look, have I done it exactly on the same mark? You can't even see it. I just went right. Look at that for a burnout. That's a whole meter and a half there of craze. 
Well, yeah, come on. <laughs> man's doing shit, man. man's doing bits. Oh, that was first gear. No way, I was not ready for that. I, I was in first gear. That was definitely a wheelie. That was definitely a wheelie. I was actually leaning forward on that one. Yeah. My gum is weak. My cheek, I can feel it. It's like just resting in my, uh, in my teeth. I don't know why, I feel like it might be swollen, and that's why. I feel like it's making me talk different. Because I am keep on biting it, although it's only gentle, I keep biting my gum, my uh, cheek. Anyway, yeah, there you go. There's an absolute, <laughs> complete novice doing a couple of burnouts. Little shit ones as well, but... Whatever, boys. Look, I'm not... I don't know how to do it. Well, I do know how to do it. I've never done it. So I'm nervous, scared, incompetent, and uh, cautious. I don't want to crash. I don't want to do my bike any damage, or I most certainly don't want to hurt myself. Look at me doing one-handed. That should be done a whole kilometre one-handed. You know I'm hard when I'm doing stuff like that. Yeah, you know I'm hard when I'm doing stuff like that. It smells like cigars or something. What the fuck? Nah, they're just gonna soak my foot, man. Ah, oh, man, this is weird. Um, what I'm doing is I'm making like spontaneous choices halfway through riding the bike when I say halfway through I mean like committing to like going around the bend committing to like red line in it committing to like dump, uh, dumping the clutch and by doing that I'm just like making like dangerous moves really like the recipe for disaster right, we come this way last week but we turned off it a bit. I'm gonna go a little bit further this time. Look at that, man, it's pure cloudy again. Like sitting in the house and the sun lights out and shiz and blazing and days and squish and age. Yeah, now, although that's not soaked through, my left foot got soaked. I, uh, I, I went for a big puddle on, on the bike. I wanted to go up there last time, it's a dead end and probably takes me to a farm which I don't really want to go to, but I'd like to go and have a look at least. This is where I turned right, just here. Gum's bothering me. It's like I can taste it as well. I can taste like a bit of damage on the inside of my cheek that's constantly being squashed in the inside of my mouth. It feels like it's a bit half damaged, chewed up as well. Well, I've, uh, I uploaded a vlog early hours of this morning. I've, I've, I say edit, I keep saying edit, but I don't edit, boys. So, the only reason I don't edit is so how else do you say it? So, I'm just going to say I edited. I edited another video today that is currently being written. Written? I don't know. 
I don't know the, the professional terms for it all. I've spliced it together and I'm now like writing it onto the computer, which then I can then publish it on different platforms. I'm not, I'm not computer savvy, I don't know all the right things to say or do. So I've seen a couple of cool little bits to go and have a look at, and they're all generally private land. On foot I think you'd get away with it, but being on the bike I feel like it gives them, it gives them more right to say, on your bike, you shouldn't be around here. Lapthorn, we've been through here before. School there, look. <coughs> nice. Right, what's the letter right here? Let's go, we'll have a look down this way. Oh, I hope it's not a dead end though. I don't think it is, I feel like I have a vague memory of this road coming this way. Coming the opposite direction. Big gouges in the grass there, land. Look at that big old trailer just sitting up there. There's a sheep underneath it as well. Is that a cow or sheep? Just sitting, I think it's a sheep. That oh, might be a cow. Nah, sheep. Just sitting there. this way before to be honest because I'm looking to just adventure around on the bike you know on tip bike having a good time I feel like this is going to take me to Brickstock oh I don't know on the pegs a minute. Look at them new houses. Look at the size of that bad boy. Look at them. Them houses must be worth a few quid. Look at them. He's got his Jeep and his Porsche in the driveway. They're like brand new sort of mansion type deal. Castile Shreel. What, we'll head home now. I've been out, I've done a little bit, and H Man is waiting in the house for me. Maybe we can get back home now and go. He wants to go swimming, boys. Oh, look, we're at Aundo that quick. Didn't expect us to be at Aundo that quick, man. You know, fair, way further out than I thought. Um. H-Man wants to go swimming in a fucking... I don't like going swimming when I'm well out of shape. I've been doing enough fit. I should, when he was younger, I used to, like, I'm talking well funny, man. I can't talk properly because my mouth... Bite, I keep biting my inside of my cheek. When he was younger and I went swimming, I used to do a bit of fitness just to keep myself in shape. And it made me feel a bit better and more confident in myself. But I haven't been doing it. I'm just like a workaholic lazy prick. I actually don't know where I am. I know I'm in Aundu, but I don't know how to get home. I don't recognize any of these roads yet. Park there.
fancy school there. Is that a school? Looks quite fancy, like it could be a school. God knows what that is. It looks like something. Look at them parking that for a building. Don't know what that is. Right, I tell you what, I think I can go right here. I think I've done this before. Should we go through anyway? Look, they look like they're still at school with them girls that got school uniform. Let's see, working somewhere. With this being, this is quite a posh village. Look, there's some more people there that look like, look at that building, man. These buildings are cool. Look, these people there on the right, they look like they're in school uniform. Right, this is quite a posh village, so you can imagine that, um, isn't that vibration coming from that? You can, can imagine that these people are still at school and that. It's a bit posh around here and then timed. And look, that was me in first gear, I think. That's why it was rattling so much. Move, mate, wait, move. Man's gonna go crazy and blaze. He was like, there was a guy just sitting at the cafe, like pure frowning with one eye, trying to um, read his paper or something. Unless he looked like that in general. Pure townie going through the town doing that. They're all looking at me like, look at that townie! Shouldn't be here! Chav looker! Black trousers, black jacket, black shoes! One cylinder! Fuck, I'm going for it. Nice little one way street here, boys. And it cuts it out. I would have went round that church and this one. Sh Whoa, look at her, boys. Look at her, like, you I know, yeah. Look at her legs. She's got tights on, isn't she? Looks like she's pure sunburn. The girl's got tights on red ones. Make her look more pink or tanned or some ink and dink and ling. Ah, oh, someone's turned in. That trans transit looks cool, doesn't it? That red transit van in front. Camera probably doesn't see it as good as the old eyeballs, but it looks quite cool. Here's another test for me. So this is twisty roads all the way home. Let's see if I can keep up with the transit. And that is, that's a lot to ask for me, you know, to be honest, that's a lot to ask. So I'm a bit of a novice in that. I don't think they nodded, but man had the pure transparent visor on him. You've got the pure transparent visor on, he's definitely a weasel. Trust, you will have the black. You know, if you want to be proper geezer, it's black, boys. Yeah, too much talking, that van is getting off. But even he's going over the white lines. Mm. Yeah, I'm nervous. Oh, that might be, oh, that would have been a cool thing. I think that might have been a road. I might go back. Oh, we've got an old rover behind us as well. I'm going to turn back. We've got an old rover behind us. I might not turn back. I might leave that to another day. I, I, I've been eyeing that road that I'm on about. I've been eyeing that for ages. And, uh, yeah, I've just never got to it. Okay, I'm going to stick these twisties, get back home. I've rattled on a bit. Get back home, boys. But that car that's behind me, I'm sure I've seen sort of car very similar to it in in an, another vlog. Uh, yeah, in another vlog. It looks like a, an old Rover Metro thing. It looks like a sporty one. He's staying on me anyway. If only I could show you. I've 
could have, I could have overtook here, to be honest. I could have overtook. I wish I did now. Wish I did. Mm, I can smell a dead animal. I like this slow guy in front. It gives, it leaves me less pressure to uh, go fast. But I equally, I wish I overtook him on that bit. I knew I should have. Yeah, look, if this car behind me turns right, and that was where I see it, at the bottom of this hill and turn right. Look, he slowed down a bit since a, a, a few, about a, a kilometre or so back, he slowed down. I predict he turns right here. Let's see if he disappears. Because that's where I see it, just down there. There's a load, yeah, there's a load of rope for things. Look, is that guy pulled in? Yeah, look, he's gone. That's the car I seen in a vlog a couple of months ago, weeks ago. And I admired it for the old original uh, Rover Metro thing. Um, but, yeah, it looked like a bit of a sporty number. Now this guy's going slow. Maybe he's got something in the back, you know what I mean? Maybe there's something in the back that's slowing the man down. <clears throat> it is twisties, these are twisties. Nah, it's safe to say I still haven't got it. Uh, I'm comfortable now because we're going slow. But these are slow bends anyway, but still. Real bikers will be able to take these at fucking 300 a lot. Here I am struggling to do 40. Camera. Yeah, right, mate. I don't listen. Right? I don't listen. Hands numbers funk and dunk and lunk and squunk and junk and nunk. Wrong gear. Smells like poo around here. Wrong gear. Get on the pegs because a slow coach and motherfucker. I might start overtaking, man. It says he's got a camera on the back. I did notice that sticker. It says he's got a camera sticker on the back of that van. Does it mean he's recording or what, man? I don't know, do I? I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't know. Look at these houses, boys. Look at these motherfucking houses. Oh, some hot bird cutting the grass. Yeah. Yeah, 
that's it boys, vlog's over, I'm home nearly. I am home times. But I feel nervous now, I'm sitting at 60 miles an hour right now, slowed down to 55 on that last bend. 60 something now. Um, but I still feel nervous, although I'm doing quite well. That, then that's quite fast bend, so it's easy. But I'm nervous, even though I am doing it as a fucking farmer and that, you little mental, you cunt, man. What are you doing on the mud, man? What are you doing on the mud, you mental cunt, mate? Wind's powerful, man. It's blowing me around, man. You just gotta stay calm and like be strong. Beat the wind. That school, new school there. Yeah, well, there you go. I've just done a big circle around a few villages. Went to Arundel and back, boys. That was not my intention, but saying that. Arundel's that, I've, that road that I didn't take that I nearly took is the road that I've been thinking about for about three or four vlogs now. I'm still not, I never got to it, so now I know it's out. Arundel ways. I've got my tripod in the back again, never did get a photo again, but it's been windy. Because, excuse me, it's been windy and cloudy. I'm just ain't in the mood. See you later boys, right? Thank you for watching. See you in a bit man. Ciao, enjoy yourselves.